It's a drone that acts as a fast response system for natural disasters. It provides an area which um, doesn't have communication network infrastructure with communication. Um, and it's an immediate um, response system. So it allows victims to um, contact family members, to contact friends. It allows organizations to contact one another to just set up ev evacuation camps. Um, through the research, in some cases, um, after a natural disaster, it took 72 hours to build up the infrastructure. That's a very long period of time for someone to not tell their loved ones they're alive. So I wanted to just reduce that time and hopefully um, by reducing that time, you reduce the overall recovery stage as well by just making sure everyone gets in a lot sooner and you just save a lot more lives. From uh, the research I conducted, I found that 44% of people found um, the baggage carousel the most stressful part of an airport along with a security check so it was kind of to get rid of this sort of stigma around the airports because obviously when people are more stressed in situations that they can't control so if I put a bit of a control into the old travel experience then it should make it a bit nicer for the people. Obviously it looks like a normal suitcase maybe a bit different from kind of the organic wheel arches and stuff but um it connects to a smartphone to activate this LED light panel um, which basically means that when you get close to your bag it starts to light up so it gives you an indication of where your bag is at all times and equipped with GPS as well. I thought at the moment there is a trend within geometric and organic design also um, a mid-century modern spin so that's what I've tried to do, I've tried to get a geometrical organic shape use um, like a mid-century materials and a bit of a styling. I think it's worked quite well. Test it out <laughs> if you want. It's quite comfortable. Obviously it needs a bit of work because this is a prototype. I think it may be a bit more upholstery would help, but I think it's reasonably comfort. So basically when you're inside there'll be like a projector um, and they'll basically project in like things popping out, they'll be with, there with the characters as if like you're in the film basically. So um, it's a it's basically a thrill ride mixed in with virtual reality. So the virtual reality part will take inside the building and then once you basically shoot out of the building, that's when the augmented reality will come in. So as you're going around, there'll be bits flying around on the screen and then that's when the thrill ride comes in. So you'll be going around throughout the trees and around the building.